We're with Mustang head basketball coach Brad Bigler following the Mustangs Hawaiian night victory over the uh, Minnesota Golden uh, University of Minnesota Crookston Golden Eagles uh, 100 to 68 and coach a nice win tonight and uh, really capped off a very nice weekend a good win on Friday against Bemidji State and, and that's what makes this so we can all uh, sweet to get those two wins. Yeah proud of the guys came out uh, it was a great effort tonight the rebounding was Probably the key early on, I think we were controlling the boards pretty good there at half. Um, we were able to uh, capitalize on the energy in the crowd, uh, impress them early, and, and uh, fortunately for us, we rushed them up a little bit. Uh, they took some quick shots, and we were able to turn those quick shots and turnovers into some points in transition, and we were able to get a lead early in the game. And of course, uh, a lot of points in the first half, uh, second straight night, you've had uh, big time scoring in the first half, and, and that's really a team effort. As you mentioned, rebounding, uh, had a rebound edge on Friday night, and again, a big one tonight, 42-17. But uh, to shoot at a high level, you need everybody, to all five players on the court to work together, and, and that seemed to be the case this weekend. Yeah, we were able to knock down some threes, uh, 21 assists. Uh, I thought our guys did a great job of on their dribble penetration, finding the five man, and, uh, both Mitch and Carter uh, were able to capitalize uh, with some easy buckets. Well, and of course, uh, you know, this night, again, second straight night, you've had uh, six players scoring double figures. Again, just a balanced uh, scoring attack. And, and uh, you know, a lot of guys have stepped up throughout this season, and uh, that is something that you're going to need here in the next, you know, three, four weeks of this season. Uh, a lot of different guys are going to be called upon to make some shots, and we saw that again this weekend in these two games. Yeah, it was nice to see those guys. Uh, you know, a variety of guys. Each guy, when their number was called, was able to knock down some shots. Uh, one thing that I was impressed with is uh, I thought we improved defensively a little bit tonight. We were flying around. Uh, just our ability, I think we ended up with 10 steals. Uh, just ability to kind of make plays on basketballs, get tips, and and turn that into points. And uh, now next weekend, you continue at home with the Augustana and Wayne State. And uh, obviously the first game is Augustana, number one team uh, ranked to the country. And uh, what a challenge. And um, you know that's all you can ask. And uh, every night in this conference is tough. And it'll be a challenge on Friday. And hope we can bring a lot of energy to, to next Friday's game. Yeah, I mean, just right now, I mean, it's not a, no different of any game. You know, we're not going to prepare any different than we have over the last couple of weeks. I think our guys' preparation has been outstanding. And uh, we'll, we'll continue to do the same routine, uh, prepare for both uh, Wayne State and Augustana, and uh, hopefully put together a great effort on it. And, yeah, and one last note, uh, great to have a 20th anniversary of the 95-96 men's team that had 18 wins, went from one win the year before to 18, and uh, great to have so many of the guys back as we try to you know, build up the legacy club for all our, our programs here at Southwest, and uh, exciting to have those guys back on. Really got this program back on its feet to, to where it is today. And Coach Ford and Coach Green, um, you know, without them giving me my opportunity and recruiting me, I, I probably wouldn't be here today. And uh, so I owe them a lot of thanks. And to see those guys before the game with those smiles on the face on the court, uh, a lot of those guys haven't been back. And uh, to see them back and to show appreciation to what they did, uh, I imagine, you know, we go from one win to 18 wins, a lot of new players, uh, a lot of guys who sacrifice, and, uh, and uh, a lot of buy-in uh, to be able to get that done. All right, Coach, congrats on the two wins this weekend. Best of luck next week. Thank you.